Hey y'all, uh, I just wanted to pop on here quick and uh, say that there, there's there been a lot of messages coming my way on multiple accounts and I just kind of wanted to do a sh very short clip um, to address it. Yes, I know everything's crazy right now. There's coronavirus, there's um, all this racism and this elite circle pedophilia coming out, um, being more and more dis exposed every single day. It, that's disturbing. It's sickening. This is all, and people tell me, oh, I don't want to hear about it. I don't want to, I don't, don't tell me. I don't want, like, that's irrelevant. We already know about it. We already know, okay? Scripture tells us. Uh, the Gospels talk about it. Revelation talks about it. This is very old news to us. Uh, there's been so much evil in this world for centuries, okay? Centuries. It's just being exposed a lot right now, okay? And I think it's our job as Christians. I, I mean, we we already know the truth. We already know that there's evil in this world. To to know peace and to know comfort, everyone's like, how do you, how do you stay so calm in this? How are you not freaking out? How are you? Because I know truth. I know God has already defeated. He has already conquered sin. He's conquered evil. He's conquered darkness. He has conquered Satan. I know this. You know this. If you read the Bible, it's very clear. I mean, he tells us in John 16, you know, I tell you all this so that you may have peace in me. In this world, you'll have trouble, but take heart. I've overcome the world. Okay. We have a promise in Jesus Christ. This is our temporary home. Our job here is to know God and to make him known, to be disciples of Christ. What are we supposed to do? I don't think us ignoring the things going on is the answer. I think we need to know and we need to be ever present in this. To It's more important now to walk boldly in faith than ever before. I think it's easier. I think we have the means to do it. We have phones, we have apps, we have social media, we have computers, we have all these things, okay? Besides just talking it, besides just saying it, we have to live it boldly, walk boldly in faith. And there's two different things by talking it, by living it, we need to preach truth, preach the gospel, preach the word, dive into it, pray for our country, pray for our nation, pray for our leaders, pray for the world, all of these things, okay? This is very, like I said, this is evil that has been going on for centuries, okay? Uh, idol worshiping, homosexuality, just pedophilia, all, all this stuff, racism, everything that's coming out. This is stuff that has been going on for centuries, okay? It's just being exposed. We have the answers. We have the truth. We have the promise in Jesus Christ and eternity. So no, I don't think you should be freaking out. I don't think we should be living in fear. How many times throughout the Bible does it reiterate, do not live in fear, okay? So I just want to encourage you. I want to encourage you to... Um, no truth to dive into the word to find the truth and comfort that only he can provide okay this video is this is not me helping you to stay calm okay you're only going to get comfort and um peace through jesus christ okay i'm just here to reassure you and encourage you to look where the answers are look biblically okay look and breathe scripture so anyway that's all i have um, I just felt like I needed to share that. And, uh, like I said, keep praying for our country, our nation, our leaders, our world, and, um, God bless y'all.